Hey guys, it's Vanessa. I am so excited that you are tuning into this video. I am on a debt-free journey with my husband and our biggest goal is to pay off all of our debt and save as much as we can to have an emergency fund as well as be prepared for our future. So if this interests you and you wanna learn more, stay tuned. Today we are going to be cash stuffing $185. So I already have all this counted, so we're just going to separate this out. I hope everybody has had an awesome week. Um, this is our third stuffing for June. I did not do a stuffing for last week because we were actually gone on a mission trip. So that was really great. Um, I am happy to be home with my kiddos um, and just back to the you know routine which sometimes can be a good thing and sometimes it can be a bad thing so I love going on mission trips because it opens your eyes um, and really allows you to have a thankful heart when you come back and you just take things for granted all the time so first thing that we're gonna do is go through our wallets and put any ones that we have aside because we roll these ones into our savings challenge. So I'm put that over there and then I'm gonna grab any of the change. Okay, so I am gonna roll any anything else besides a one um, into the next week. Groceries, oh jeez. So my nails are struggling, I actually, was like, oh, CVS had some nails, fake nails to, um, with the glue on clearance. So I was like, I'll try them, you know, because I don't have enough yet to put aside for my nails and a pedicure. And I would, I really like to get them both done at the same time. And literally within one day, two of them already popped off. So the struggle is real. Anybody can relate to that? Or maybe you're one that you can get them from the drugstore and they stay on. What is your trick? Do you have a certain brand that you buy? Because listen, this like $40 to go get your nails done that last two weeks, I mean, that's hurting the bank. So I'm gonna put these in my, my change jar. Okay, beauty, no one's there. Okay, personal. I actually did not spend any personal money this week. Oh my gosh, that's like, a first but I guess it I've only been back since Saturday so it's only been four days but still that's that's great okay pets I did I'm gonna roll that because we're saving entertainment I'm gonna roll that couponing I'm gonna roll okay everything else I'm gonna roll let me check my husband's really fast make sure okay so he has a dollar back see where he is for hair didn't spend anything in hair personal spend it all in date night no okay so the first thing I'm gonna do since I have my husband's out is I'm gonna go ahead and stuff his so for dine out he's gonna get 25 so we got a 20 and a 5 and now he has 30 and I'm gonna grab my pen. An update is calculations here. We actually just had family dinner at Chick-fil-A and I love me some Chick-fil-A, but oh my gosh, it was like $32 for all of us to eat. It's just amazing how much everything is these days. Um, but it was nice to have the money. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna say that. I'm gonna be thankful for that. Okay, um, $10 for hair. And let's see here. That'll put us at 10, 20, 25, $30. These are all folded because he wants a small wallet and it drives me nuts. So, Cause they get all folded. But you know what? It is what it is. 
you can't win them all. So there's that. Okay. So now we have 30. I hope that's right. I literally forgot as soon as I counted it. I'll recount it later. Okay, personal, we got 10, and I'm going to do two fives for him. We usually use this money to go get coffee, honestly. Even though we have a really fancy coffee maker, I don't know. It just tastes better when somebody else makes it. Am I right? Okay. 10. And then date night is getting 20. So we got two, four, six, eight, and then date night is getting 20. So we're at 100 now for date night. Looks like we need to go out. He's off all next week. He's taking, we're taking like a staycation. So maybe that'll be a good, good time to go out. Okay, so his wallet's done. Okay, I'm gonna do my personal wallet. Oh, I gotta take this out. I paid off some of our bills. Um, so that needs to go back into our... Um, oh, this is... I'm like losing my mind. This is actually my sinking funds. Okay, I'll go ahead and do my sinking funds. This is how you know you're tired. You know, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Health is going to get a 10. This goes to any of our medical expenses. Copays. Um, it got kind of cleaned out because we all like lived at the doctor the past month. Um, we had a case of strep that would not go away. And it was just a lot of medicine. Um, and doctor visits, which even with insurance is ridiculous. So... Now we have 25 again, so we're, we're slowly building it back up. <laughs> so, okay, birthday. Birthday's getting five. Okay, and we got 20, 30, 35, 40, 45. Okay, clothing is getting 20, and I'm going to take this quarter out. See. Put that in our jar. Um, we took the family yard selling a couple weeks ago um, and found a good bit of clothes. So I would definitely recommend if you're on a budget, go yard selling, because I got my son some tennis shoes, and they were pretty much brand new. So... Um, especially when you have kids, man. They just outgrow things so fast. Any mamas can testify to that. Okay, so we got two, four, six, eight, nine, ninety-four. Let me count that again. Two, four, six, eight, ninety. Yeah, okay, ninety-four. Thought I thought that were wrong for some reason. So now we're saving up for school clothes because that's gonna be like around the corner. When do your kids start back school? Because I feel like everybody is just going back earlier and earlier. Like in South Georgia, they go back like the end of July. That's insane, right? I remember when we used to go back in September. Okay, so now we got car. Car's getting 10. Okay, so we got two, four, six, eight, 10, 20, 30, 40. So we got 140 on car, which now my husband's car is making a noise. So, I mean, seriously, when it rains, it pours, right? It's like, seriously. Okay, insurance is getting 10. Okay, so we got two, four, five, six, seven. So 70. This is literally just to, this is going to be a slow stuff um, to meet my goal. But this is to be able to finally pay our insurance in full. Um, because you get a discount. 
So right now we're just trying to, you know, give a little bit of the oomph stuffing. Um, but eventually I really want to be able to put that money aside every single month. Okay, gifts. We're doing five for gifts. 10, 20, 30, 40. Yeah, I hope everybody had a great Father's Day. I know that we had a relaxing one. It was just really nice to be home. Like I said, we had just gotten back from our mission trip, so it was perfect timing. Okay, maintenance. This is mainly going to our pool right now, but really it's anything, anything that we see needs maintenance. So I'm gonna give maintenance a 10. Okay, so that's going to be 20, 40, 50. For those of you who have a pool, you know chlorine costs a lot of money. That and just balancing and all the tests and everything. It's just a lot. Okay, and savings, we are going to put in $10. And then I'm going to roll in these ones. So, let me grab these ones. Lots of ones here. Let's see. Organize this a little bit better. Okay. Okay, so we got one, 150, 170, 180, 185, 6, 7, 8, 90, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 200, and two dollars. So yay, we made $200. And this is literally like in a month and a half. So I would encourage anybody to do this because that's $202 right there. That mainly has just been from change and ones. Um, so it does make a difference. Okay, utilities, we're not gonna stuff that today. And I think that's it, okay. Oh, you know what, I have pets because I did grab the flea and tick medicine finally. So let's grab that out of my, there it is. Okay, pets are gonna get 10. Okay. I can locate where it is later, it's fine. The tracker is in there somewhere. Okay, so for pets, we just bought their flea and tick medicine, and honestly, it was more than I thought. So I definitely think I am gonna switch um, providers because the other doctor was way cheaper. Like, I'm talking like $15 cheaper. Okay, 10, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. So now we're saving up for the next big purchase for the pets. Okay. So the sinking funds are done. My husband's wallet's done, now my wallet. Okay, so for dining out, we get 25. Okay, that would leave me at 30. Okay, and groceries. We are cutting back on our grocery bill a little bit. Um, just because in summer I don't have my full income and so that gives us a little bit more of a wiggle room. Plus it's a good challenge to see if I can get all of our groceries for 150 versus 200, which I will say I've already dropped it. We used to spend $280 on groceries a week. Um, and when I started couponing, which I'm just gonna put that plug in. If you haven't watched my couponing videos, make sure you watch it. Um, when I started couponing, I knew that I could get it for cheaper. So then I dropped it down to 200 and most of the time we don't even spend 200. So now I'm trying to see if we can drop it down to 150 because that would be a really big deal. And you think that, you know, $50, oh, that's not a big deal, but that's an extra $200 a month that you could do stuff with. Okay. Beauty is getting 10. Okay, so we got 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. Yeah. 
Okay, personal. I'm going to skip that one because I have that 20 already. Entertainment. Oh, this goes to... I took this out because we did go to the... We went to the park. Oh, not the park. The, uh... Gosh, I can't think. We went to, um... We went to go pick blackberries. Um, so I'm actually going to stuff 10. So I'm going to give myself change here. I forgot to do this earlier. Okay, so 20, 30... Man, I'm making a mess. 20, 30, 40, 50, 6. Left in entertainment. And that needs to go in my sinking funds. Even though I might start carrying that in my wallet just for the summer because anybody else with me? Okay. Um, couponing is getting 25. And we have 30 in it now. I just feel like, you know, when you're with the kids over the summer, especially because we're not really taking a vacation this year because we're really hustling on trying to save money, I actually am going to stuff this 10 since I make broke that change. Um, so now personal, we'll have 30. Woohoo. You can get lots of coffees with that. Um, since we're not, you know, going on vacation or anything, I just want to make sure that the kids get to do something fun. So we went to go um, to our local farm, which I highly encourage you to do. Um, and we picked blackberries and blueberries and that was a lot of fun for them. Plus I discovered that my kids are totally obsessed with blackberries, had no idea. So there's that. Um, it was just a lot of fun. And for two little things, it was only $8. So that was cheap entertainment. Plus they had a playground um, and I got to get out of the house a little bit because you know, sometimes you just get a little stir crazy. So. Anyways, that is it for today. I hope you guys have a wonderful week and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.